Hey, I'm Zadie, and I am going to talk about scuba diving. Where can you find peace, silence, and tranquility? For several hundred years, people have said the experience of being one with nature is life-changing. However, most people do not go after that. It just doesn't seem that important to them, and boy, are they missing out. Though there are vast opportunities to experience being one with nature, only a few of us actually do. As a child, I was lucky enough to have parents that believed in taking time to be part of nature in all its forms. From camping in the Rocky Mountains during the coldest parts of February to beaches all over the country. The best place I've ever found to be one with nature though to find peace, silence, and tranquility is in the water, which is why I became a scuba diver. Learning to scuba dive comes very natural to some, and not so much to others. I was one of the ones who did not come to it first. I would get very nervous before getting in the water, and while under, <laughs> but the more I told myself to relax, the better it got. If you want to experience the magical world under the sea, scuba is the way to go. Getting certi certified is key to safe and enjoyable diving. The first certification you get is open water. This starts with book work. Yes, I know that sounds pretty boring. Reading almost 200 pages didn't sound that exciting to me either. However, this gives you the foundation you need to start diving. The book will teach you a great deal, and the more you know, the better. There is really a great deal to learn about diving, and it can be pretty overwhelming at first, trying to remember so many little things that you never do on land. Diving takes you into a different world, and you have to be prepared for that. Training is essential because every diver needs to understand how to handle a situation if something were to go wrong. And there is a lot that can go wrong. Don't let that scare you though. It doesn't happen that often, but better safe than sorry. Knowing how each piece of your scuba gear works is also crucial. This will keep you and anyone you're diving with safer, not to mention the peace of mind. Scuba equipment has made it possible for humans to survive in an environment that has no breathable oxygen for them. If you've learned to swim, you've probably practiced holding your breath for long periods of time. Don't do that. It goes against the golden rule of scuba diving. Always keep breathing. Always. It can be scary, but retraining yourself to continually breathe during a dive makes all the difference. Breathing helps keep your ears equalized and also helps your body become and stay relaxed. Deep, slow breaths in and out. Furthermore, having the proper equipment will make diving much easier to learn and find delight in. Tanks and regulators are the two breathing apparatuses you will use while underwater. Your tank holds your air, and the regulator allows you to breathe air from the tank at whatever pace you want. On top of that, you will need a face mask, fins, and a buoyancy compensator device, or BCD. Fins help you move smoothly through the water without completely exhausting yourself. And the BCD is used to carry your tank and help you stay at the right depth without using a great deal of energy. Optional equipment are wetsuit and snorkel. A wetsuit is great if you're diving in cooler water, and the snorkel comes in handy if you're swimming out to a dive spot. And that way, you don't use up all of the air in your tank before you even go down. The underwater, underwater world is an alien world to most humans. You will see many different species of fish, eels, and sea cucumbers, to name a few. That really is only a few. <laughs> While diving, you will see animals you didn't know existed. To be able to immerse yourself into their world 
is a privilege. The ocean is full of life. Some of it bigger than school buses, and some so small that the naked eye can't detect them. <laughs> there are many predators you won't be used to. Barracudas, sharks, and different poisonous species are actually just as unused to you as you are to them. Something you should keep in mind while diving if you find any of them. Staying calm and respecting their world, which normally you couldn't survive in, is essential to diving. Other wildlife you might run into are sea turtles, who effortlessly glide through the water as if they're flying. Crabs and lobsters walk along the ocean floor or in coral formations, their beady eyes watching your every move, whether you see them or not. Sea spiders can be found in coral areas as well. Some of their species can grow legs larger than the human hand. <laughs> Eels and octopus enjoy coral reefs where food is abundant and there are ample places to hide. Even the coral is alive in this ecosystem, so don't stand on it. <laughs> Many thousands of species live in the world's ocean, but you most certainly will not see them all at one dive spot. In fact, there are many creatures that only inhabit small areas of the ocean. The wildlife changes depending on where you are in the world and the time of year. The one unique and non-changing piece to every part of the ocean is that they each have non-living treasures to be found. The ruins of cities, plain and shipwrecks, monuments once standing tall on land, now I'm standing tall underwater. You might even see submerged cars or large kitchen appliances. These are not found often, but quite the treat when you do find them. The sea is full of treasures, living and non-living, and scuba diving is the best way to see this. Other world, and it's in our own backyard. The experiences you have while diving cannot compare to what we see on dry land. Connecting with this world can be easier than connecting to nature on land for a lot of people. The animals don't have schedules to keep or meetings they'll be late to. Sounds are scarce, which you'll find to be very relaxing. Relaxing and taking in the beauty around you, well, it will take your breath away, figuratively, of course. This underwater world is where you will find peace, silence, and tranquility. Go try it. I can guarantee your life will be changed.